Hello everybody, what's up? Beanie Gunso here and welcome back to me playing Deponia. My bad, Chaos on Deponia, aka Deponia 2, whatever, how you feel, foots, bloat, whatever's going on over there. Okay, so this is Beanie Gunso here and last time we left off I got beat up by two thugs. Okay, now this is the gacha shop I think, because I really need to go ahead and look at him showing his head. Let's put it down. Awesome and impressive and immaculate and all that stuff. Okay, so I'm going to go into the actual gacha shop, me thinks. And get some cartridges. Let's actually try to progress through the game here. Yeah. Welcome to Gilligan's Gadget Garden. You are being served by Shopomat 2000. How may, may I help you? Uh, yeah, Doc sent me to get a set of cartridges. Of course, we currently offer two different brands. The first is Platinum, Platinum Proof, Proof Professional. Professional. They are somewhat more expensive, but of better quality. There is a cheaper kind as well. Cowboy Dodo's Jolly All-Purpose Cartridges. Cowboy Their Dodo's. quality may not be top Dude, I love how the shopkeeper's just freaking out. He's kind of like, let me free! Lollipop. I want to escape this robot. He a has lollipop. trapped me inside his body. So which brand do you prefer? Let's get the, um... Give me Platinum Proof Professional Qualities of the Essence. Um... And those are really the good cartridges? Of course. Remember, gold's mind is at stake here. All right. Here goes nothing. Where did I get the lollipop from? <laughs> um, click, click. That's the best screen transition ever. Hmm? Oh, <laughs> The deed is done. Man, I miss Spongebob. Old Spongebob season Did three. Did it work? And movie I'm Spongebob. not sure. No, Something one seasons one through right. three. No, seasons one through movie, I should say. Rufus? Oh, I might have known. Why does the same question pop up in my mind every time I set eyes <laughs> Just on you? Yeah, who's that good-looking guy in the snappy overcoat? Where am I? Because the aura of my magnetism is befuddling your sense of orientation. Huh. Seriously, where did you drag me off to this time? And what is that awful smell? This is the floating black market. You're safe here. Safe? Rufus, I was on my way to Elysium. Well, yes, you were, but with, with the, the wrong, wrong guy. guy. Cletus wanted to help me. And you trust that lying slime bag? Yes. Who I am more likely to trust, my fiance or his cheap imitation? Hey, what's up with you? What's up? I wake up only to find myself in some stinking torture chamber. That's what's up with me. I'm already itching all over just because I'm forced to breathe. Oh, this must be one of her personalities. I'm reading about so much to about in the description. I need to get uh, out of here. say reading about in the description. My mistake. Girl, don't leave me. I saved your life, girl. That was Seems my fault in the first place. Mad. Not really. I just have a certain effect on explosive women. What? Lighting the fuse? Hell yeah! They're very oh. funny. But she actually did seem a little volatile. Are you sure you didn't mess her up somehow? Hmm. I think I might be able to explain this. Some information wasn't written to the cartridge. Almost as if we'd used the cheap ones. Not as cheap as your excuses. Her mind appears to have been split three ways. So, the woman who just stomped out of the lab is only a part of Goal? And not the most agreeable part, I hope. Come on, Doc. I thought you were an expert. It is nothing that I can't fix. But for that, I need all three cartridges, including the one that is currently inserted in her implant. Also, I cannot operate without the consent of the patient. Therefore, all three parts of Goal must cooperate before I can go ahead with the surgery. Oh yeah, judging from her mood, she'll be positively enthusiastic about you flipping open her skull again. Hmm, agreed. Maybe you had better start with a different part of her character. Huh? Take the two cartridges that are still in the output hopper. And this thing. What is it? A remote control? Not quite. 
See that compartment in the back? Just insert one of the other cartridges and press the button when you're close to go. Okay. That's what I said. A remote. It's more complicated than that. Data's written to a buffer and... And I can zap back and forth between two characters. No. Yes. Something like that, but... Just like a remote. Just like a remote. Cool. I wish I'd had one of these for Tony. Hurry up, Rufus. The longer the fragments of her character get used to their independence, the more difficult it will become to talk them into having that surgery done. Go find gold and persuade her. All three parts of her. I, I will prepare her. everything else here With in the meantime. My three magical sticks. All that right, I have in my here we pocket. go. Okay, so I guess I just leave now. And to the lock. Shut that door. With. I'll open this door. With. So not to look for it. Someone tells me she's gonna be at the tavern because I haven't been there yet, but let's go. Outside Doc's workshop. And let's go to the tier room. I meet to LTLA to the tavern of Tavern Ocity. Tavern. Of course, I can access the map from all the way back here. Cool. So, Bell Fuse, you know. Hold on. Which would be the quickest? Place and Belfie's way up there, the marketplace. Doesn't matter either way, this would be the, probably the quickest uh, area to go. Methinks. Okay, so I'm click the dock. I'm gonna go there, hopefully, I won't get beat up by two one eyed thugs again. That wasn't cricket. Let's go to the harbor. There's the tavern, and I need to go there. Oh, cool. It's so clicked it. And I guess I'm going to magically walk there anyway. Oh, see, there's one of them right there. Nod. Bozo. Gulliver's Travels. And Garlef. Let's see what else can I click in here. Oh, a lot of things. Let's talk to the Razorfish. Yo, what's up with you, Razorfish? Hey, hold still! Oh, darn it. Oh, it seems to have some sort of motion sensor. Is that supposed to be a Razorfish? To me, it looks more like a sword. Uh, well, I was more about that right now. Let's go down here. Look, right here. It's like the nod of this creepy bastard. That's one of the guys I beat up outside the city gate. <laughs> I have to be careful. Uh, that's hilarious. Oh, wait. Go. I didn't even see her. Did she disappear? Or am I tripping? No, I, no, I, don't, I don't remember her being there, but I was, let's talk to her proper self. It's fancy. It's All right, fancy. Rufus. This is a <laughs> oh, he walks to her and he walks back. That's man awesome. Like yourself. Easy peasy. No reason at all to be nervous. You are eloquent and witty. Very handsome. And your hair smells of solvent. Now, for the right facial expression. The romantic, the daredevil, the thinker. Let's see, do I go with the romantic? To her. Uh, hmm. Pitchy self. Ah, the daredevil, as I talk to her. I've been a stuntman. I have to think of I think about every possible solution to this problem that I'm facing right now. Let's go with the romantic! Here it comes. <laughs> Check. Charm cannons at full blast. <laughs> and now to come up with the best possible line. Ooh la la, pretty woman. Hey, baby. What's up? What's up? Oh, Sup. that's it. A classic. Take a deep breath, and then... <sighs> Here I go. Hmm? Oh, heavens, it's you again. You never give up, do you? So, uh, are you mad at me for some reason? You had to come with me and see Doc. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Oh, there he goes again. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, oh, <laughs> I can't pick that one because you'd be like, yes, he did hurt when he fell from Elysium. Elysium. I lost to say something. No, that just seemed the funniest, though. It did indeed. Oops. Oh, right. Yes, I, I can imagine. We're actually not all that different. Neither of us belongs on this planet. That's right. I belong on Elysium, and you belong in solitary confinement. No, no. What, what I meant was we belong together. We, we are soulmates, so to speak. I have no idea where you get that notion. I am sophisticated. I am educated. Check. Check. I haven't got any communicable diseases. Uh, but I still maintain that we're, we're very similar. Just don't come too close to me, will you? Ooh, I kind of like this Tucker British version of Gaul. Kind of gets me going. What's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? What's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? Good question. What am I doing here? Oh, I remember. You dropped me from the escape pod. Saved you, dropped you. Doesn't all that depend on, on the point of view? <laughs> Only if you're a short-sighted idiot. Hey, Luckily, that's easy I to verify. I'm short-sighted. Hey, but Bozo, I'm no idiot. did I rescue Goal? No idea. I gave up trying to understand what you were doing a long time ago. You see? Bozo thinks I'm cool, too. Here's looking at you, kid. Why? Do you have a sty or something? Now that you mention it, I, I've actually got a little eye infection. Ugh, keep your distance, okay? I don't want to give up. I'm going to have to. That's not my choice, though. I'm afraid I already know you better than that. So, what? Are you mad at me for some reason? Yeah, well, huh? So, this is where you've been hanging and out. Believe me, I would much rather be on the West Promenade by the Rotating Gardens. At this time of year, Morris serves the best soya chino in all of Elysium. Soya Instead, chino. I'm sitting in this hole in the ground drinking... What is this, anyway? Camel drool. What else? Camel drool. No, wait. The camel drool's still under the counter. What you got there is the tincture for my nail infection. Ah! Oh, does that mean you bathed your filthy nails in this? Yeah, but go ahead and drink it. Apparently it only works on fingernails. And this is where my mechanisms of repression should be kicking in. Ah, here they are. You have to come with me and see Doc. What for? So you can demolish my head even further? Ah, really turned your head, did I? <laughs> Turning heads and demolishing them are two different things. Not in my book, girl. Not in my book. Tony they weren't. Listen, Rufus, I am dirty, my hair is a mess, and my head feels like someone sliced through my skull with a circular saw. Yes, but there's no proof. And to top it all off, I'm starving. So, you had better stay away from me. Hey, if you're hungry, I've got a leftover bowl of peanuts from our last mud cake festival. Oh, yuck! It's growing hair! I bet this little bowl contains more killer bacteria than a biological warfare lab. Nah, we're all out of killer bacteria. These are influenza viruses. Wow, what kind of bar is this? <laughs> and I took the peanut. Uh, you must come with me. Something went wrong with the surgery. You must come with me. Something went wrong with the surgery. What do you mean, something went wrong? Well, y you know the fairy tale of, about the three bears? It was pretty much like that. Just that there were no bears. And that your mind was, uh, you know, split three ways during botched brain surgery. That's all. <laughs> what? what? No, 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 don't panic. I'll fix everything. <laughs> Could I interest you in a romantic dinner? Uh, yeah. Could I interest you in a romantic dinner? A dinner invitation? Really? Huh. Maybe there is a spark of gallantry left under that filthy coat of yours. Dinner first. You can go looking for my gallantry later. Oh! Which restaurants do you have in mind? And is it clean? A restaurant? I was thinking of, you know, an extra serving of peanuts. I mean, they're free, aren't they? 
Yeah, if you don't count the doctor's bill. Ah, great. Oh, it sounded too good to be true. Just forget it. What do I have to do to make you come along? First of all, you should look up the meaning of the word no. <laughs> yeah, all right, let's assume I just did that. What would I have to do next? <laughs> Wait, what the hell is this? Can you sing the dumb bum song for me? And then that was the response. And that was the question he asked. It was weird. Won't you please just come along? Nothing to do about along. the dumb bum song. No, I didn't think at all about a dumb bum. Can't that we speed this up a little? We both know. know the bum that is not dumb going on there at all. I said no. And if you were a gentleman, you would know what that word means. Are you mad at me for some reason? Whatever makes you think that? You kidnapped me, caused me a bad head injury. That's not the way I remember it. You appear to be suffering from a perception disorder. And the you mean, we in reality, to... you're not sexy at all? Just stay away from me. Understood? Where do this one? Hold on, this this is on. Could I interest you? A dinner invitation? Really? Huh? Maybe there is dinner. You can. Which rest and a rest? I was. I mean, they're free. You don't yeah, count the doctor's bill, of course. Uh, <laughs> just forget I'm it. I'm a dirty ass. Ball keep. Sorry, did it hey. hit you? Uh, there he. I give up. I give up. I'm afraid. Wait here. I'll be right back. Is that a promise? Of course. Good. That increases the chances that you'll stay away. <laughs> what a woman. Okay, guys, I'll just stop it here. Thanks for watching me play a game in a Let's Play series that I enjoy very much. Whatever, I'm just trying to end this on a good note. Whatever. But seriously, though, thanks for watching. Peace.